Hey guys, Ryan Martian here, and today I want to briefly discuss something I came across on Instagram pertaining to a possible Gina Malone appearance in the theatrical cut of Batman v Superman Dawn of Justice. These are potential spoilers since the theory has yet to be confirmed, but just to be safe, you have been warned. Instagram user Ryan Unicomb, number one, I hope I pronounced that correctly, and number two, no, it's not me, posted a picture taken during the nightmare sequence, and it suggests we may have actually seen Gina Malone's character in the film even though Zack Snyder said her appearance was cut from the theatrical version. Snyder has also stated that her character is neither Batgirl nor Robin. That being said, a Redditor posted this handout he received after a sneak peek, which lists Malone's character as Barbara Gordon. This could be interpreted in two ways, if the handout was indeed real. Her character is either Batgirl or Oracle. This in and of itself could be debated ad nauseum. But let's move on to the actual film, and allow me to possibly narrow it down based on what we see, along with some facts about the Barbara Gordon character from the comics. I've seen the film twice now, and I did notice that Batman reaches out to pull someone away from the gunfire and parademons closing in on him during the sequence. It was very quick, and there was so much going on that I didn't pay much attention to it. However, the more I think about it, I find it to be a real possibility. As soon as Batman finds out the whole deal was a ruse, he immediately turns his head toward the back of the truck and yells, "No!" Now this could just be a reaction to the deal going sour, but it appears there is something, or someone, outside of the truck that is important to him. We see many people get gunned down during the sequence, but he only reaches out to help one person. If you look closely at this picture, the person appears to be a female, based on the feminine features of the arm and fingers with short hair and what looks like a mask, or even a cowl. If this is indeed Gina Malone, and therefore Barbara Gordon, we can throw out the theory of her portraying Oracle, because in that version of her character, she is paralyzed by the Joker and Alan Moore's The Killing Joke, and confined to a wheelchair. She is obviously mobile during the scene, so that would lend credence to this being... Batgirl. Guys, this is a very, very loose theory at this point. But the Instagram post intrigued me a bit, and I felt the need to do a quick video about it. Zack Snyder loves Easter eggs, so it wouldn't be a complete shock if this theory turns out to be true. It could also be complete bunk, so we'll just have to wait for the R-rated Ultimate Edition to be released in a few short months. Which I am really excited to see. Shout out to Ryan Unicomb for catching this, and I've left the link to his Instagram account in the description if you guys would like to follow him. As always guys, Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, drop a like or subscribe. Thanks again.